to my channel. So today I have the well-awaited Q&A that I promised you guys. So I asked everybody on Twitter, my Twitter is at Beauty by Chloe, to ask me some questions and I will be featuring you guys on the screen. So I have all the questions on my phone and this phone case is from Kate Spade. It's a little kitty and I decided to put on my cat ears to match my phone case. So I have a lot of questions here and I kind of divided them into two sections. So like the ones that I could answer like really quickly, like all my favorite things and then the other questions that are just random and have longer responses. So, my favorite season is summer. My favorite makeup brand is Too Faced. Literally, the quality is amazing and it's so girly. My favorite food, as you guys know, I'm vegan, so love a lot of vegan food. So, my favorite foods are potatoes, bananas, smoothies in general. Oh, and this like avocado chickpea sandwich that they make at their restaurant near me called Kai's Kitchen, which is like amazing my favorite vegan treat i love any like vegan brownies or like vegan cupcakes or cakes just my favorite animal slash do you have any pets i do have a dog named lily grace and she has a pink nose she's been in like clips of my videos before <laughs> doing the furry friend tag once like summer rolls around so we could be outside together. Also my favorite animal are dogs. My favorite TV shows are Gossip Girl and Friends. I finished Gossip Girl like a year ago and I watched it through twice and I'm currently watching Friends and I'm on season five so please don't spoil it for me down below. My favorite movie slash my favorite old Hollywood movie slash my favorite Audrey Hepburn movie it's actually like all in one I love breakfast at Tiffany's oh, cat. poor slob poor slob without a name the way I look at it I don't have the right to give him one we don't belong to each other we just took up by the river one day I don't even want to own anything until I can find a place where new things go together I'm not sure where that is but I know what it's like it's like Tiffany's Tiffany's? I've watched that movie like four or five times now and I just love it. I love Holly Lightly and her style and just the storyline is just so cute. And also with that question, Princess Gabcake asked if I'd love her back. Yes, I do. My favorite singers are R5, which if you haven't heard of them, look them up. They're amazing. I've been fans of them since like 2012. Um, also Ariana Grande and recently I've been loving Melanie Martinez. My favorite song, I have like one favorite song from each of those artists, so I'll be playing those right now. song my favorite album by Ariana Grande is yours truly because it has like that vintage doo-wop feel to it I just love it and are you excited for her new album yes like I've been waiting for this for so long like really long time like whenever she posts new music like I just get obsessed with it and like listen to it non-stop the longer questions I got I got a lot of who is your inspiration um, so I don't really have like one person that I look up to. I looked up to like a lot of different people for like different things. So, um, I look up to Audrey Hepburn because she was just like a really sweet person. I look up to like lots of YouTubers. So like Nikki Philippi, Gabby DiMartino, love her. Also Emmeline, if you're watching this, I look up to you too. <laughs> like a lot of different vegans who are like really into like the activism and stuff. Because I feel like I'm an activist like online, but I don't actually go out to like spread activism i don't know i wish i could kind of like get involved a little bit more with that who's your style inspiration i think i've said this before but my style is basically 2013 ariana grande really girly but then sometimes i'll dress like really chic so like audrey hepburn like all black and i love like pearls and then also sometimes i'll feel like trendy and dress like 
a Kardashian with like my knee high boots and like long sweater or even sometimes I'll just like really girly and cozy. Next, I got a lot of questions about like LA and moving there. Where do you wanna live when you're older? Anywhere in Southern California, it doesn't specifically have to be LA, because one, I really, really, really love warm weather, and two, the fashion industry there. Um, why not New York? Because it's really cold. But what age will you live in LA? Um, I'm aiming for like 19, 20 to move out there. And when can we go to LA, says Brianna. I don't know, sometime like in a year or two, I'm planning on like taking a trip there. Do you wanna be a YouTuber slash what are your plans after high school, like career wise? Um, I definitely want to be a fashion stylist. How I get there, I don't know yet for sure. I'm definitely taking a gap year after high school to like finish up the community college course that I'm taking on fashion and hopefully get like an internship and maybe work my way up there and become a stylist or I'll go to LA and go to FITM and get my degree and then become a stylist because you don't really need a degree to be a fashion stylist so I don't know exactly what I'm doing there. I just know I want to be a stylist and I do not want to stop YouTube. If I can make YouTube like a career for me then I will definitely like pay attention to that. I know I'm definitely focusing a lot on my YouTube that year, my gap year because I I really will have a lot of time on my hands so um, yeah I definitely want to grow my YouTube channel and be a youtuber Paris or Manhattan and where would you go on a vacation um, I would choose Paris because I've never been there and that's also where I would want to go on a vacation I've been to Manhattan before and it's really nice there I just it's cold I mean Paris is cold too but I think I like French things I definitely want to go there if you had one chance to time travel, where would you go? I would go back to the 1920s because it just seems really fun back then and all the vintage things, just like perfection. And I would go to like one of those great Gatsby parties. It's always been a dream of what makes you feel better when you're sad slash what makes you happy whenever I'm sad the first thing I do is take a shower to like wash off all of the sadness <laughs> I know that's weird then afterwards I will like get into really fuzzy clothes if it's like winter because I'm usually like more sad in the winter I'll get into fuzzy clothes get in my bed and go on Pinterest yeah that's basically what I do when I'm sad and what makes you happy I love like relaxing I love good smelling things um, I love lots of fruits and vegetables like I literally get excited over blueberries um, my dog makes me happy I love going on runs that makes me happy too if I'm like really really upset I'll go on a run and then I'll take a shot and the last question I'm going to be answering is actually like really cute if you were a Chanel perfume which one would you be I would be Coco Mademoiselle it's pink and it's very girly and feminine so definitely would be that one fun fact I actually don't like the way Chanel number no. five smells I think it smells like an old lady. So that is the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed and learned a little bit more about me. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like it. I hope you all have an amazing day and I'll see you guys soon. Bye. It ain't even cold outside. Not where I'm from. Fading like it's mid-July.